boom, 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 boom. Welcome back. Welcome back to Mars Polo Channel Review. Today we'll be talking about what is on my mannequin. Also a nice little cop. Um, first and foremost, um, uh, boy, feeling a thousand percent better. Um, I appreciate everybody who, you know, the Insta Instagram, you know, checking on me, see how I'm doing. I'm good, you know what I'm saying? I'm back to normal, thank God. So, you know, let's get into it. First off, I want to go about this um, cardigan. It's like a, a nice blue cardigan with the white hints in it. It's very nice. Um, also, up underneath, it has a shawl neck, of course, polo Ralph Lauren shawl neck. And underneath that is a blue Oxford. I just wanted to give it a little color up underneath um, because, of course, whenever you wear white, the white always stand out. So, so that's what I wanted to do with this particular um, setup. I'll push it back for y'all a little bit. So, this is more like a, <laughs> I know people will be like, that's a soccer dad look or that's a, um, what's that, Mr. Rogers look. You know, Mr. Rogers coming in with the cardigans all the time and pop, pop, you know, clean. So, you know, but that's. That's showing you my age. But anyway, <clears throat> so with this particular um, setup, I, this is more like a casual look. You know what I'm saying? Not necessarily doing too much. Of course, I'm, you know, always trying to tone my, my situations down. Um, not necessarily screaming polo, polo, polo. You know, it, you know what it is whenever you know. You see what I'm saying? So with this particular setup, I probably rock like some nice denim jeans not too dark because you still want that um pop going on and i just think with a dark denim it'll it'll tone it too it'll tone it down too much so that's what i like and also the shawl necks you know i'm 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 crazy for those um whenever you look at shawl necks you just want to make sure the material is great whenever you get them you know what i'm saying quality it's all about quality and one thing I'm noticing between like Ralph Lauren and his cardigans between Blue Label and Double RL, Double RL is more of a hand knitted cardigan and those things are heavy. So that's the reason why they put so much emphasis on the craftsmanship of the Double RL cardigan and that's the reason why they cost so much. So yeah, just gotta be aware of those things, especially when you're out here looking so I suggest if you can find a double RL cardigan around 300, 320, jump on it. Especially if it's handmade, you will not go wrong, wrong in that aspect. So let's talk about some word events here. Um, you know, COVID is still out there, so make sure you're protecting yourself, protecting your family. Uh, and, you know, I really don't do politics on my channel. I ain't really into politics, but... One thing I am a strong believer in is the Second Amendment, right to bear arms. Um, please go out and get your gun license, get your firearm, protect you and your family, or whatever the case may be. And I get it. People going to be like, well, you know, guns kill people, blah, blah, blah. No, people kill people. Guns just, if you leave a gun by itself, a gun is not going to fire off by itself. So that's just my little spill about gun safety. <laughs> gun safety and protecting your family. Um, so let's get into a cop. And with this particular cop, um, I copped it, I want to say, I copped it a few, I want to say a few weeks ago, but I haven't had time to do my review on it. So I'm finna show it to you. And then I'm gonna give you my honest opinion about it because it was a, a hot item at one point in time that I was like, I gotta have it, I gotta have it, I gotta have it. But then when I got it, the quality is, anyway, we'll go over that. So, boom. This particular, <laughs> I want to say wool rugby shirt. It's dope. It is dope. You know, it's it's it's, it's wool, and the collars are wool with it. And this is a new it tag situation. So the price tag is three hundred dollars, right? We both know I didn't pay three hundred dollars for this. To be honest, I paid 50 bucks for this off Poshmark. So, yeah. Me and I, um, the, he wanted like 120. I like, nah, I just give you 50 bucks. And he accepted. So, yeah. This particular piece is dope. It's just that the wool and how long it's going to last is the problem. Um, 
when I got it, I looked over it, and the quality is there somewhat. And then I had people, well, the, my few people know I got it. Well, how you going to rock it? How you going to rock it? I don't know yet. You can go with a blue or a dark blue khaki and just rock out like that. But then you don't want to look like Blue's Clues or something like that. So I might just wear it with some denim or something like that. It just rock out. Nice little jacket, khaki jacket. But this, this particular item, it's dope. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm glad I got it. You know, I mean, like I said, I'm not paying. I, must, I wasn't going to pay $300 for that. If I'm paying $300 for a garment or an item, you best believe it's going to be high quality. I'm not just going to be buying an item just to say, well, I got it first or whatever like that. Um, also, outlets. So, that particular shirt was at the outlets, and they wanted, I want to say $300 for it <laughs> there um, or two something. Um, right now, the outlet has the cricket sweater with the tweed patches on the side of it. It's like a orange and blue. It's very nice. It's very nice. Now, I want to say they want $300 for it, too. But if you get that 30% off um, coupon, I think that's a nice little combo. You know what I'm saying? Also, they have the sweatsuits with the RL on the um, on the front and on the pockets of, the, of a sweatsuit. They have that, too. And some outlets have the varsity jacket, the green one with the tiger on the front of it. I don't know if a tiger is on the back, but, you know, it's the outlet situation when it comes down to that varsity jacket. So they probably still be asking around five, six hundred dollars for it. But if you was on top of the original green and yellow or tan um varsity jacket that when that particular one came out i believe it was like almost a thousand bucks if i'm not mistaken so it's like yeah but you know do you that's what i would say do you you know when it comes to styling things you know what look you're going for don't let nobody deter your own style you know, with theirs or try to implement what they got going on as far as what you like to dress like. You know, me personally, I like rugby. And um, also, shout out to the bros, Fleet, you know what I'm saying, Ron, Mel, Cliff, um, the Rugby Kings, you know what I'm saying, go follow our IG page. I'll put it up in the beginning so that way you can come out and, you know, just, just show your love and support to the bros. Uh, also, still rocking with, with the Brodies. Yeah, Dex, you know what I'm saying? Big Boo, you dig? Our, um, man, man, the Brodies, you already know. So, salute to them and salute to the movement and the culture, you know, and um, just love the culture. You know what I'm saying? It's about, you know what I'm saying? Just showing um, showmanship, you know, uh, and just, you know, just build a network of good people. You know what I'm saying? So, it is what it is with that. So, salute. Have a great work week. Today is Sunday. So, you know what I'm saying? Enjoy your last day of rest for those who are off, the ones who work. You know what? Your time is coming to be off. Unfortunately, I have to work tomorrow. So, I just want to go ahead and show some love to the Brodies. You know what I'm saying? And the people I kick it with. Salute the pink. Pink Polo 2. That's my, hey, that's my ace right there. You know, if you follow me on IG... You know, me and Pink Hat go live time to time, talk about real life situations, real life topics. Um, I got a salute to Frontline up there in Philly. See you doing your thing up there. The movement going great. Continue to push forward, my brother. Um, and just, you know, come on, come on, come on over there on IG. M O underscore 55. You know what I'm saying? We, we, we chop it up a lot. You know, we, uh, we like, we just love fashion. You know what I'm saying? Love it. So, with that being said, oh yeah, like, share, subscribe, tell a friend, tell a friend. It's all positivity over here. Ain't none of that uh, throwing, throwing shots and all that. Too grown for that. You know what I'm saying? Been out grow that situation. But anyway, like, share, subscribe, tell a friend, tell a friend. And you know, we almost up to, I think, 800 subscribers now. We almost there. Let's get it, people. We almost there. Let's go. Salute.